Thank you for waking us up this morning again to see the brightness of the day. Of our viewer listening to the word for today, may they truly connect to a that will deliver their glorious destiny in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. The word for today is this. Beware of adversaries. They always come when doors are open. God is giving you this warning today because doors are already opening for many of you on this platform. Almost the same time last year, the month of September, October, when God told me, of enemy at their corridor of success. There are some, there, those people are just, they are meant for that purpose. They are different from those ones that are making sure that they don't succeed. Those ones that are trying to frustrate you when things want to work well for you, you know, they are militating against you, trying to wrestle you not to succeed. Now, there are other forces that when you have already succeeded, that is when they come. Beware. That is the one God wanted to deal with today. Many of you are a day to success. Many of you are few seconds to success. Very, very sure of that. Be careful. Very powerful two scriptures that he has given to us for today. Corinthians chapter 16, verse 9. See, for a great door and effectual is open unto me. There are many adversaries. A great door has been opened. In that place, there are many adversaries. He didn't say a trouble door has been opened. He didn't say a failure door has been opened. He didn't say a demonic door. A great door. A lovely door has been opened. A good door has been opened. But there are many adversaries. It comes with it. Now, compare that scripture with the book of 2 Samuel chapter 5 verse 17 but when the Philistines heard that they had anointed David king over Israel all the Philistines came up to seek David and David heard of it and went down to the hole and so said this they were there when this poor boy was in the wilderness running after cricket and the uh, chips the bible says 2 samuel chapter 5 verse 17 he said the day that the news of the fact that david has been anointed went abroad they didn't come to celebrate too. that was the day they came for fight so what is god telling you from that scripture he said Anytime your sources open, enemies will come with it. So God is also warning you that when you succeed, don't relax because many of you are going to succeed. That's what God wants to do with the platform. Many of you are going to succeed. So don't lose your guard. Don't lose your guard. Be at a lot. Now, David did not sleep there. David did not cry there. He went down there to, go, to confront them because he knew he was a man of war, always prepared with his army. He came to him, he went down there to the hole. He didn't check it out. You say, oh, I didn't know they were coming. Oh, my sword. Oh, I have already dispatched my men to go and enjoy with their wives and uh, to go and make merry. Just one very small sources. Go back again. You know? 
rise a little, go down, rise a little, go down. Why? Because they are not conscious of this instruction that some enemies are at the corridor of sources. If they got you before, God is telling you now so that they don't get you again. They say, that was why you went down. That was why you went down. We hit it. We're dancing, celebrating too much and forgetting the fact that you have, you have overpowered the ones that were confronting you not to even succeed. After you have overpowered them, don't think that you are free. As you have overpowered them and you enter into your breakthrough, you say, there are other ones waiting for you at the corridor of success. So every Ahitophel around your life waiting for success to come for them to set you up, by this word you are hearing today, the Lord will dislodge them in the name of Jesus Christ. Every Ahitophel that they are not doing anything now, but they are, you, at the moment you shall see they rise up against you by the power in the name of Jesus. The Lord will dislodge them, every of them. God will dislodge them in the name of Jesus Christ. So as God is going to stand by you to help you fight this battle against every demonic forces that want to arise at the corridor of your sources, you also stand firm and confront them. Jesus' mighty name.